they were yellow smooth skin, we were fat and balding. I nodded at a muscular guy carrying a catcher's mask. It was like watching myself going out as I was coming in. Inside the locker room, I packed up quickly. Some of us took showers, but it seemed silly. We hadn't really worked that hard. I folded my uniform top and kept it as a souvenir. I zipped my bag shut. I sat for a few minutes, fully dressed, then there didn't seem to be much point. I exited the way I'd come in, through the employee's entrance, and there was my father, smoking a cigarette and looking up at the sky. He seemed surprised to see me. Thanks for the cleats, I said, holding them up. What are you doing out here, he said, annoyed. Can't you find someone to talk to in there? I spurted out a sarcastic breath. I don't know, Dad. I guess I just came out to say hello. I haven't seen you in like two years. Jesus, he shook his head in disgust. How are you going to get back in the game talking to me? Yeah. Uh, you mean we're almost done with this part, and when we're done, then I'll let you. Yeah, so he goes out, says hi to his dad, and his dad's like, excuse me? Aren't you supposed to be in there making connections? Finding you a baseball job? Why are you out here talking to me? Like, Dad, I haven't seen you in two years. You dropped off my cleats, didn't bother to say hi. I thought I would say hi to my father. He was like, get back in there and find a job. You know, as always, his dad is worried about one singular thing. Baseball. And without that, there's no point. At least not for him. That's the whole point of his relationship with his son. Baseball. Chick finds out his mom is gone. Hello? My wife's voice sounded shaky and disturbed. Hey, it's me, I said. Sorry. Oh, Chick. Oh, God. We didn't know where to reach. <laughs> But I sense deep down that I'd never see him again. I never did. I lost both parents on the same day. One to shame, one to shame. Now, I really think one of the most important lines in this book is here. I drove with my shock and grief in the back seat and my guilt in the front. So, I mean, obviously he's sad that his mom is gone. Of course he is. He's, he's mortified. You know that it was a spiral that sent him down. It was so hard. Part of it, probably not. I mean, it's not like his dad knew. Hello. Hi. Thank you. Uh-huh. 